In Parliament today, MPs are debating the hot topic of the proposed referendum on defining marriage in the Constitution, over which parties are divided, with the ruling Social Democrats and Liberals opposed and centre-right parties generally in favour. The Committee on the Constitution has put forward December 1st as the date for the poll. A counter-initiative opposed to the holding of the referendum on marriage equality bans submitted to Parliament this morning a request for the Parliament to put forth its views regarding the question posed by the referendum. The initiative was launched by Croatian journalists via the Facebook. The Parliament received the same request from the LGBT community on Tuesday. Speaking to Croatian television last night, Prime Minister Zoran Milanovic addressed, among other issues, the referendum, saying that he would vote no. Meanwhile, constitution expert Sanja Baric commented for Croatian television last night the request for the assessment of constitutionality of the question posed by the referendum by saying that the constitutional court can be only addressed by parliament, while citizens, NGOs and other interested members of the public can only contact the constitutional court once the holding of a referendum is actually confirmed. Baric said she believed that parliament should forward the referendum question to the Constitutional Court as it has sparked so many doubts and dilemmas. Speaking to the Globus Weekly, Finance Minister Slavko Linic has commented on the possible cooperation with the IMF. Linic said that the lending conditions could become much better and Croatia will require any assistance available. The Finance Minister added that all the possibilities should be discussed, but the final decision was for the government to make. Negotiations are continuing between the Ministry of Health and Doctors and Healthcare Workers Unions on a new collective agreement. The head of the Doctors Union, Ivica Babic, which has been striking at hospitals throughout the country for 50 days, has said he believes that talks may be completed by the end of the week. Some 12 people have been arrested on cigarette smuggling charges in the wider split area, among them two policemen. Apart from the two policemen who have been charged with abuse of authority, all others are suspected of forming a criminal enterprise. The group has embezzled 6 million kuna during a seven-month period. And in sports, at the final Masters tennis tournament in London, the Croatian-Brazilian duo Ivan Dodig, Marcelo Melo have beaten the first seeded Americans, Bryant Brothers, by 3 6, 6 3, 10 8, and the first match of Group A. And turning to the weather for the rest of the day clear or partly cloudy along the coast, while partly or mostly sunny inland, with northern areas seeing most of the cloud. Moderate winds along the coast with strong northwesterly winds in the open. Sea slight to moderate, while choppy in the southern Adriatic. Top afternoon temperatures ranging between 16 and 20 degrees.